changing dimension styles. I'm going to come up into my dimensions panel and go into my dimension styles. Here I have a couple dimension styles. If I want to change it, I go over and ch pick the modify button. In here I can make any changes I want. I could make a change such as uh, display my alternate units and say OK. And I've just made a change. I can come back here at any time and make that change come back. And so I can make changes. I can see a preview of those changes in here. Now, I can set, um, at this point, I can set something to be overwritten. So when I pick override, I can come in here and I can make a change. And so an example of a change, I might go to my text um, and I might go to, um, oh, let's see, what should we put in here? I'll go to my primary units. And in my primary units, I might put something in here in, let's say, my suffix, where I might say max. And I only want to do this uh, for a few dimensions. And I'll say OK. And so I have a, what's called a style override. It will place that word max in my dimension style until I change dimension styles. Uh, so once I actually go and switch dimension styles, um, I make another dimension style current, it will go back to its original mechanical inch. So um, it's an override for just a handful of dimensions that I want to do, uh, which is saves you from creating all kinds of dimension styles just for those examples.